Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. All right, here it is. Stendar's Beacon. So I parted ways with Among the Hist so that I could come here to meet Varanya, who was determined to restart the Vigilant here, although it doesn't seem that she's been very successful. I see empty beds. Uh, here is a uh, shrine to Stendar. Let me pray. Stendar, grant me your wisdom and your power. Let me meditate. All right. More stamina so that I can carry more. Let's go ahead with blocking and apocalypse proof. Perform a time block to mitigate incoming fire, frost, and shock spells and effects, reducing their damage by 50%. Ah, I have apocalypse proof level 2. Perform a timed block to mitigate incoming fire, frost, and shock spells and effects, reducing their damage to zero. And why wouldn't I want that? Okay, so... Performing three successful time blocks in a row completes a timing streak, restoring 75 points of stamina. Taking an unblocked attack or blocking an attack outside the time block window breaks the combo. Sounds like I've got nothing to lose with that. Alright, let's, before we... Alright, let's do a power bash. It's something I've always wanted to learn how to do. And we will take Skull Rattler. Bashing does 3% more damage per point of stamina. Alright, we'll stop here. With the blocking. Let's see what else. Alright, I did want to get the cushioned to take half damage from falling if wearing all heavy armor. Yeah, I don't want anyone to flee from me. Let's go ahead and increase our enchanting mastery so new enchantments are 100% stronger. Soul gems provide 10 extra weapon charges per level of enchanting. There we are.
I'm going with Sacred Guardian, emanate a 20-foot aura of protection. Any living allies within range who fall below 30% health are automatically healed 150 points. This effect has a 30-second cooldown per target. I'll hold on to my last point. Actually, I think I needed to put something in one-handed. Yes, we made it to 80. So let's go ahead and one-handed weapons will now do 80% more damage and critical strikes with one-handed weapons do 4% more critical damage per level of one-handed. There we are. Thank you, Stendar, for your blessings. All right, hopefully Varanya is still here. Aha! Uh -huh. Along with this avatar. Excuse me. You speak to a vigilant of Stendar. Cavort with any danger, and we will hunt you down. Faranya, you know me. So you return. Yes. I trust Stendar's blessing aided you in your quest. It did. It helped immensely. Praise be to Stendar. Excellent. And as a true disciple of Stendar's teachings, perhaps it is time you lent your blade to the cause. I've been lending my blade since I first met you back in the Hall of the Vigilant. So tell me... How may I be of service? Your alacrity is commendable. You would make a fine vigilant. If you were to wear the cloth. I'm already wearing it. Alas, we have no time for initiation rituals. Thus, you will accompany me as an honorary vigilant to Kronvanger Cave in Eastmarch. All right, now, Kronvanger. as I informed you previously, our focus has shifted recently from the danger to the vampire menace. The cave is believed to be one of the strongholds, but this information is unreliable. It could be another trap meant to divide our numbers. Hmm. So, I'm an honorary member of your faction of Vigilant. You need to come to Solitude to see my faction has grown quite a bit. I think we probably have the same this numbers that were at the hall. This watchtower as it stands on the border between three provinces. It offers prayer and safe passage to travelers to and from each. However, as we stand on the fringes, the vampire have laid waste to the countryside. Indeed they have. To reach the cave, we need only travel to Lake Honrich and follow the path north up the river. However, as an adventurer, you may know of a more direct path. Thus, I will allow you to take the lead. Time is of the essence. Very well, then. Seems as though we're headed to Krovanger Cave. Hmm. So, by agreeing to help you, I've helped the people here in this area. All three of them. So I'm entitled to Thanehood. But let's go before I digress. All right, we're here at Krovanger Cave. Come on, let's go. You know, you're always welcome to join the Solitude Branch of the S Vigilant of Stendar. I know you're determined to create your own branch at Stendar's Beacon. But there are many more like-minded people in solitude. Let's go. The spider eggs outside mark this cave as a beast lair. If the Nightwalkers live here, there must be a secret entrance. All right. Fighters. Oh, 
All right, one down. All right, it looks like there's many more coming. Nothing like using restoration as a weapon. <laughs> all right, they're all destroyed. Let's keep moving. There's that way, and then there's this way, with this button, and I'm sensing something on the other side. Take care of them all. Pray Stendar. So, if these are thralls, the vampires can't be far behind. Where did Varanya go? Master Vamp... She killed it? Varanya. So who killed the Master Vampire? If you were stuck up there on the, the ledge. Thaden! Blast! He was one of our best men. The cowardly beast must be trying to pick us off one by one. Hmm, so you did have some members. From the shadows and find comfort in numbers. They have not the valor to walk in the light. On the contrary, Vigilant. Theirs is a formidable race. Among the hills. We must acknowledge their strength if we are to vanquish them. And what kind of monster are you to walk amongst these demons? He's no monster. He's with I am me. No monster. I am a soldier in the war to cleanse the land of impure blood. Then you're with the Dawn God. No. Ours is a group that dates back to the Oblivion Crisis. I am a member of the Order of the Virtuous Blood. Virtuous Blood? I've never heard of such an order. True, the Order's presence is not as widespread as the Vigilance. But while yours was to rid the land of Daedra, Ours was to purge the unclean. This war was thrust upon you, but we have been fighting it from the moment we were conceived. Then you will tell me what you know of this place, soldier, and where to find the rest of this clan. It is not ours to tell, but another may provide for what you see. The two of you follow me, and I will show you what I mean. Let me repurpose this gear. Silver hand bracers, no. Stendar. Before you Watch arrived, over you. I had been watching this cabin for three days. Ours was to wait for the rest of the clan. When you eliminated the thralls, I had no choice but to join the fight. I found this one pressed against the shadows, completely invisible if not for magic. Yours is a train in detecting life. 
to find Daedra wherever they hide. But vampires are members of the undead. A vampire? Why does he still live? Explain yourself. Calm yourself, Vigilant. His is a blood that has not fully spoiled. Perhaps he knows where his clanmates have run off to. Very well. Interrogate your prisoner. But when it is done, he will answer to Stendar for his crimes. I apologize, boy. The High Elf has seen many of her friends die at the hands of the impure. Just as your life was stolen by their wickedness. The unclean. The ones whose blood is spoiled. They are not your family. You need not protect them. Mara's eye. <coughs> they came from Mara's eye. <coughs> Through the ice. The Volkiar. No. No longer with the clan. <laughs> Twins. Like Rinori. <laughs> Tell her. I'm sorry. It was my fault. <laughs> the what? Divines cleanse your blood. The Divines bring us together once more. Indeed they do, Ours Hist. is to delight in your passing. Yet, this is not the time for a lengthy reunion. I know the ones he speaks of. Twin Dunmer. If the rumors are true, they once served Clan Volkiar. Of course, they say these two were afflicted by three separate diseases. Power, hunger, and madness. If Clan Volkihar is truly as paranoid as the tales say, then you can see why such a pair would be exiled. <laughs> All right, well, I never knew that hunger was a disease. But we must do our best to vanquish these fiends before they infect others. Agreed. Vampires may cling to the fringes, but we cannot mistake this for cowardice. This cave is proof of their ferocity. That is all fine and good, but you have yet to reveal how you know these twins. What are you hiding? My soul is bare, Vigilant, as are my words. Yours is to listen so that you may understand. There are stories of vampire changelings who prey on children and take their forms. The Telboth of legend are one such clan. They simulate their lives. They come home to their victims' families and eat at their tables. They let the mothers of the dead kiss their foreheads and tuck them to sleep. And when they have grown to full size, it is the parents on whom they feast. These twins, Elroth and Egrind, they were my old partner's kin. He knew them, loved them, raised them. His was to tell me a story of a cold, bleak night, when the walls of his home were painted in blood. Nonsense. What you speak of are nothing more than children's ghost stories. They are vampires, are they not? Then they can be slain. Moreover, we are not a married couple looking to rear children. The craven tactics you describe will not serve them on the field of war. Come. Let us hurry and be done with these vampires. Every minute we are separated from Stendar's beacon puts it in further peril. As you say. Alright, let me look at this chest though before we go.
take that sapphire. All right. Let's go then. All right. Everyone made it out safely? Good. Mara's Eye Pond. Let me check the map. Oh, it's not far at all. Let's go. All right, here we are. Look out, there's crabs here. cast in the water. Apparently they're too far. What's this? A lich! Destroyed it with restoration. Let's see if we can get across here. Wait, another one? All right, everyone. Let's go. Sensing anything in here. Well, we're here. Where, pray tell, are the night stalkers your hostage promised us? Do not tell me that boy played us for fools. Patience, vigilant. I believe his was to tell the truth. These crates could be filled with supplies and food, ransacked from the docks of Windhelm. That proves nothing. They could belong to bandits. Smugglers, even. Perhaps. Yet they could also belong to vampires. Stocking up for a protracted dawn. There. Look is the there table. something I can do for Fresh you? Fresh bones and blood. Who is this citizen? This it is a vampire. Not entirely useless after all. The question now People. is, where have they gone? What do you need, handsome? Yes, it does seem rather peculiar that not a single vampire would remain to guard these supplies. Hi there. But well, here's a single vampire. The supplies themselves were meant to hide I'm something deeper. The only one seeing you this. Need something. The pond is surrounded by land, but the water here runs underground. You spoke to the sister, did you not? Hers, whose family was taken? Remember what she said about the vampires? How they used the river to phase through the ice? I remember. What sister? Phasing through ice? What is he talking about? A family was abducted by vampires near the docks. Then they could already be on their way north. We must hurry lest their numbers swarm. What if they didn't swim up the river to snatch their victims? What if there was a tunnel that allowed them to travel right. to and from the docks? There's We're already fairly deep. How much further can we possibly descend? I am unsure. The trap door, it must be in this pool. That's where we'll find them. 
Is it getting hot? Or do you see? All right. Stendar did not punish me for this. So it was a righteous kill. Stendar, have mercy upon these souls. I mean, it's obvious that this is a vampire den. Look at this skeleton, a bloody skeleton on the table. Come on, let's go. like another vigilant has been slain. So you did recruit some people. I'm sorry, I doubted you, Varanya. All right, people, let's go. It seems your instincts were correct, Argonian. I was wrong to question you. How is this to appreciate the gesture? Let's not count our hatchlings just yet. I'm glad the two of you are getting along. There's no turning back now. In this case, we will be better prepared if we assume the worst. Very well, then. Stand our protect us all. Indeed. again. Let's see what you've got. Yeah. Uh. All right. Let me, well, first of all. That's all you've got. I have no mercy to spare, even. Empire thrall. Why is this thing? Who hissed? Is this your doing? And this creature, you summoned it. A Dramora with Daedric armor. There's a darkness in you. I knew it. All right, let's get out of here. that creature is gone. All right, it looks like it's this way. Look 
out. There's people down there. Interesting. Another victim. A dark elf. Hist. Anything? All right. Let's go. Varanya. There was another body. Probably another victim. Cleared them with Stendar's might. Let's keep moving. stand the light at all. Walk always in the light, or we will drag you to it. Stendhal's mercy. How deep does this canyon go? It's a long way to Windhelm, Vigilance. And the further we descend, the less obstacles to tunnel through. It must have taken them centuries to dig this. Uh, if there is one thing a vampire does not fear, it is time. Hmm. True enough. But they fear the light. And we will cast it upon this tunnel and burn their souls to dust. Well said, Vigilant. Let's go. So powerful, I didn't even get a chance. Not even a chance to finish my spell.
Alright, let's keep going. Another corpse. And a dark elf. Like cowards, they prey upon the refugees and take advantage of the Jarl's indifference. Or they act as refugees themselves. Theirs is to play the same game they played as children. They walk amongst the downtrodden, posing as their kin. If what you say is true, then the girl's story was a lie. She says they came from the river, that they phased through the ice. Your attachment to this brother and sister is affecting your judgment. How can we be certain they are not the twins we seek? I... I Just. don't know. Let us see where this tunnel ends. It may take us to the bottom of the white or inside the city. Then we'll know for sure. All right. The Windhelm Warehouse. You see, Rinori was telling the truth. On Who's the contrary, that? Argonian. We may be near the docks, but we're still inside the city. Silda. Do you think a god would notice a horde of vampires <laughs> diving into the river? We're on the other side of the bank. There's no strategic advantage to using this tunnel whatsoever. Unless your aim was to get inside the city walls. You... You may be right. Was I blinded by what happened to our lass? Is this girl no different than that child? It seems I am in need of your counsel once more. You have spoken with the girl. What do you think? Does it matter, Hist? Vampires are in the city, one way or the other. There is truth to your words. We know someone has been using this tunnel, and time will tell whether that person is a friend or a stranger. We should head over to the corner club and ask if there have been any new refugees. If not, then following her will be our best lead. All right, let's go. All right, here it is, the new Genesis Genesis Corner Club. Let's go. Speak quickly. Quarter would be Let a haven for anything. my kind. Yes, I'm wrong. It's about the twins. Yes, sir. They've been so helpful, but mm -hmm. I was wondering if they could spend another night here at the corner club. Need something? Ellen has some company coming the over. Great quarter is not and much I'm to look at. Are you here to bully us and tell us to so leave? Bad. Running out of room, eh? I'll be glad to help. Uh, pardon me, but these the twins you speak been of, filling up at night where lately. do they come from? I'll bet Elder up at Candlehearth is jealous. They're refugees from Morrowind. Just arrived last week. Pleasant lads, the both of them. We've all been passing them around. We might from be home poor, but is it really any better out there? Lucky for Amberys, we had to cut our turn short. You hate the Dark Elves. Are you it's here to shame, bully us eh? and tell us to leave? They've been so wonderful to Not have around the house. Not a day passes that I don't wonder if life would be Please better in Morrowind. Are harboring vampires in this very hmm. building? Vampires? <clears throat> Up the stairs. Don't let them escape. I don't see why we should live as an underclass to the Nords. If anything, they owe us. Look out. Come on. Coming through. What are you doing? I know you want. I think I got a clean mother. What's going on? They're here, invisible. Yeah. 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 
It appears we've arrived not a moment too soon. No Apparently. doubt these two were ingratiating themselves with the locals. Had they been allowed to succeed, the Grey Quarter would have suffered an epidemic of vampirism. Moreover, the Jarl could have used it as a pretense to purge the entire city of outsiders. Thanks to our efforts, both those circumstances have been averted. My goodness, I'm being pushed out the door. The Grey Quarter has seen enough turmoil. I'm glad we prevented more. Yes. Although, as much as I hate to admit it, if the area had been infected, it is likely that the Jarl's actions would have been justified. If a few innocents are lost, it would pale in comparison to the number of casualties that would occur if one abomination were allowed to live. Yes. In any event, it seems Arlas will have a measure of peace now that his kin I have thought been the banished. Grey Quarter would be a haven for Still, my kind. the war rages was on. wrong. Yes. And I, for one, am glad to have you on our side. We may have our differences, but you have proven yourself yes. worthy. The Order of the Virtuous Blood is a friend to the Vigil. Yes. And here I thought we were going to leave on bad terms. Why would you How assume such a you? thing? I have been nothing but courteous to you. <laughs> I can How never can I tell you? if you're using humor. <laughs> I can't imagine why. In any case, thank you again for your assistance. How can I help you? But I must take my leave. I'm headed back to the beacon. Until next time, How vigilant. can I help you? Divines guide your path. Yes, until we meet again. Walk always in the light, for both yes. of you. And to yes. you as well. The vigilance takes her leave. Towers has one more task to complete. Really? I have spoken with Falion about a cure. The Great Corner is not much to look at to now, but it wasn't always so bad. A cure? All right. The corner club's been filling up at night lately. I'll bet Elda up at Candlehearth is j All right, tonight's hunt went splendidly. We brought the two new fledglings along and showed them how the river conceals our movements. The Argonian boasted he could do without the potion. But the fool didn't realize it wasn't for his lungs, but for his eyes. It wasn't long before he gave in and drank the vial. He complained of the taste. Onions, I told him. He thought I was joking. The night fell quickly as we made our way to Windhelm. Now is when the hunt is most ideal. The surface of the river is layers thick, sturdy enough to walk across. Yet, there are points in the flow where the ice melts at the slightest touch, and when the hunt begins, we phase through them effortlessly. Their blood glows like hot sun skating across the ice. I reach up and grab one by the ankle. He will make for a fine meal. The tunnel is almost complete. To think it was only three quarters of the way burrowed when we found it. I will miss our nightly forays into the river, but we have plenty of identities to use, and the Jarl's border policies have whittled our prey's numbers. Besides, Egrin is right. There is something nostalgic about feeding this way, worming our way into the Grey Quarter, earning the people's trust, just as we did when we were children. So, this was all true, Hist. All of it. All right, let's we go. We might be poor. Renori. Feldus, mother, father, we're dead, aren't we? All of us, even me. But is it wrong to want to see them again?
Feldus is gone. He wanted to tell you. He wanted to tell you that he was sorry. Feldus? You spoke with him? Where is he? I want to see him! I am afraid it is too late for your brother. But there is still hope for you. I spoke with Falion as promised, and his was to provide a cure. It... it's you, but I want to wait for mother and father. At this point, waiting is not a choice. I can see how much you have suffered. It is as Arles said. Sickness is a virtue. I do not know if this cure will even work. Ours has doubted its existence since the moment I joined the Order. I have never believed in miracles. And I realized the road to Morthal is long, and you will endure a pain I cannot possibly imagine. All I ask is that you try. Uh, I'll try. For Feldus, for Mother, Father, for everyone. Thank you. All right, during the light hours. I'm not sure with time dilation how long Remember, it will take to get there. The ritual must be conducted during the light hours. All right. It will not work if we are cloaked in darkness. All right. I got you. Good, you're here. Stand in the center of the circle. We shall banish the creature you have become. He means you, Renori. Right. Right here? Yes, yes. Now where did I put it? If you are looking for a black soldier, you will not find one. Ours was unable to end a life, to act as judge over another. Yet, as I took Arla's life, I am in position to judge myself, and I deem her to be more virtuous than I. No, you can't! Hist. It is What are you talking late. about? The poison has already taken effect. Poison? Treasure the life I give you. Honor those who were lost in this war. And to you, my Hist. friend, no! I rest easy, knowing you will carry on the fight. I what ask have you, you done? once more. What is the meaning of war? Even now, I may not have all the answers. But ours was glad to fight it. Would someone they call a friend? Very well. I call upon Oblivion Realms. Please, don't do this. Yes, no. Answer my plea. No, by Stendar's mercy. Rebel. Stop it, I beg you. Accept the soul that we offer. Return life to the creature you see before you. He's dead. He, he's dead. <clears throat> No, and I, you, you're normal. I don't want this. Not like this. Hmm. I am so sorry. I didn't know this is what he planned. Neither did I. I would have never allowed it. It should have been me. But I. I have to do my best. He gave me everything, and I owe it to him to do the same. He said he hunted vampires, but he was so kind. I never even knew his name. Hmm. 
It was among the hist. That's a beautiful name. I'll remember it always. The sun. It's so warm. Thank you. I I'll never forget what you've done for me.